It's finally here. The season us deer hunters wait for ever so impatiently all year long. Our crew's been busy planting new food plots, getting mock scrapes set up, putting up trail cameras with excitement for the pictures to come, hanging tree stands, taking down old sets with excitement building for the new ones. I hope you're ready because this is the 2024 deer season. Well, welcome back to the channel guys. It is October 5th, early October. We are in the tree stand. This is Dylan's first sit of the year. It's only my second. We are on a different chunk of property and one that we've had a few decent bucks, but there's one that he's kind of, I would like to call him the ghost nine or uh, um, threes, I think is what we call them too. Either way, really nice buck. Um, I've only got one picture of him though, so. We uh, are doing a hanging hunt tonight. We got our saddles out. There is some really heavy trails coming off of this ridge. I'm excited to be uh, back out hunting this time of year, back with the bow in my hand, so hopefully we can make something happen. We'll keep you guys tuned for all of it. Wish us luck. October 6th, it's about 80 degrees today, 25 mile per hour winds, we're going to go to a new spot, move some stands around, there's a cold front coming in tonight, so tomorrow should be really good, we're just going to check out today. Get out here with my cousin Gabriel. Oh yeah. Going to try to double up tonight. Let's see what kind of luck we have. Elevate Outdoors Army, let's go. Hell yeah. Go down, go down. Oh my god, I was holding the draw for like five minutes. 
She was pumping blood the second I shot her. Oh my gosh. God, my shoulders are killing me right now. That was so sick. The second I shot her, I just saw blood spewing out. That was unreal. I have a three inch broadhead. Schwacker broadhead. So I think I punched her right through the lungs. She ran right to the woods. Spraying blood. We got more deer. We had eight deer right by us. That was unreal. Let's go. Let's go, game. <laughs> October 6th, two days before my birthday. Smoked her. Oh my gosh, that was awesome. First deer of the year. She was spraying. Shout out to Elevate on Boys. It's gonna be a great season. Let's go. second set of the year so looks like I shot her right through the uh, right through the rib cage and it came out right at the uh, right behind the shoulder so not a bad shot 15 yards I think didn't have a range finder but uh, I just waited until she got close enough to uh, I was confident to shoot so that's good stuff first day of the year All right, well, it is October 11th. We're still in early October here. It's a pretty warm night and it's a lot windier than I expected, but it's a Friday. I got time to be out here and uh, it's pretty pretty good wind for it. So earlier I had to actually move this setup just about 10 yards. Um, the spot I was in, there's a dead tree leaning over towards it and just wasn't a safe spot anymore. My old stand, right here you can kind of see the straps well this tree right here I don't know if you can tell but it is dead and it has fallen over and there's just some small branches up there keeping it up so when it does slip it's gonna feed right down the crotch right to where my tree stand is so we don't want that to happen I got kids to get home to <laughs> moved over a little bit I'm still overlooking the same stuff we've got some standing corn out here a couple of our old food plots that have some perennials still in there and there's a two track feeding right in towards me and one that's kind of going horizontal so I don't really know what to expect to see tonight but 
I'm good with shooting a doe or a buck tonight. So we got a cold front coming in over the weekend, kind of hitting it on the front end, but we were rigged up in the saddle. We got the Matthews hanging right next to me. I'm ready to go. Excited. We got about two and a half hours till it gets dark. So hopefully we catch some good deer movement and can put something on the ground tonight. Doesn't look like they're gonna be coming in. 